You know, I used to think Apple Mail was just that old default app, the one that exists simply because macOS has to come with some kind of mail client. But then macOS Tahoe came out, and I thought, all right, let's give it a chance. And guess what? I was genuinely surprised. So here are 10 Apple Mail features that actually work and make life just a little bit easier. You know what I love about macOS Tahoe? Apple finally remembered that we, normal humans, don't live in just one email tab. Now Mail supports tabs. Yeah, just like Safari. You can open one email in a new tab, keep another in your inbox, leave a third as a draft, and jump between them without chaos. It's perfect if you're juggling multiple conversations and don't want to lose track of who said what. And then there's the new column layout. It's like Mail looked in the mirror and decided to grow up. On the left, your message list. On the right, the preview and quick actions. Clean, minimal, and it honestly looks like something straight out of an Apple promo video, where everything's perfectly organized and nobody ever spills coffee. They also added advanced filters. You can click unread only or attachments only right in the toolbar without digging through menus. It's instant, smooth, and finally, you don't have to scroll forever just to find that one important message. If you, like me, spend half your life in mail, the two-column view is a lifesaver. It genuinely makes navigation faster. Try it yourself. Go to View Layout, enable the dual column mode, and you'll wonder how you ever lived without it. You know what absolutely blew my mind in macOS Tahoe? Apple finally gave Mail a little artificial intelligence, and it's honestly like having a personal assistant who actually reads your emails for you. Now, instead of drowning in 20 paragraph threads, I just hit summarize. And boom, Mail gives me a neat little recap, like the client said yes, but wants it next week. Perfect. It also suggests smart replies, those short, polite responses that make you look professional even when you're too tired to type more than okay. And the best part? Mail now highlights priority messages, the ones that actually matter. So I stopped wasting time opening newsletters I didn't remember subscribing to back in 2016. It feels like mail suddenly got a brain, and honestly, I'm not mad about it. And here's another classic moment. You hit send and instantly realize you attached the wrong file. Now, a little undo send button pops up at the bottom, giving you 10 precious seconds to save your reputation. You can even extend that timer in the settings. A tiny feature, but it saves you from some very awkward oops moments. Sometimes an important email comes in, but you're in a Zoom meeting, stuck in traffic, or just not in the mood. Now you can simply swipe the message to the right and tap Remind Me in an hour, tonight, whenever. Mail will bring it back to the top of your inbox exactly when you need it. It's like having a personal assistant. Only this one doesn't ask for coffee. Here's a feature that makes life a little cleaner. Got an email from someone who's been driving you crazy? Just click their name and choose Block Sender. Mail instantly stops paying attention to that person. It's almost like real life, but without the awkward explanations. And then there's this one. You're in a work thread, and suddenly everyone starts replying, Thanks! Got it! Okay! Now you can simply mute that conversation. The emails stay in your inbox, but no more pop-ups or sound alerts. Finally, you can work in peace without jumping every three seconds. If you have an active Apple iCloud Plus subscription, you can choose Hide My Email in the From field when composing a message. Mail instantly generates a random alias that forwards emails to your main inbox. Why it's awesome? It's perfect for signups, newsletters, or anywhere you don't want to expose your real address and it keeps your inbox free from spam. Pro tip, keep an eye on your aliases. Go to System Settings, iCloud, Hide My Email to manage or delete them. This feature isn't brand new, but in macOS Tahoe, it's much more integrated and can now be accessed directly inside Mail. While it's not a completely new feature either, Mail in Tahoe has become smarter with automation. You can now combine rules, smart mailboxes, and automatic categorization to organize your inbox without lifting a finger. Here's how it works. Create a smart mailbox. For example, attachments over 10 megabytes or from boss and unread. Then set up a rule. 
If an email comes from X and contains the word Y, move it to folder Z or flag it automatically. It's like turning mail into your own personal filtering assistant. Pro tip, combine rules with categories. For instance, have all messages marked as promotions automatically archived or snoozed. If you've ever tried to send a video by email and got the dreaded message too large warning, forget it. MailDrop uploads the file to iCloud and simply attaches a download link instead. You can send files up to five gigabytes, no problem. It even works if the recipient's on Android. And honestly, that's on them. Mail can now also hide your IP address and block tracking pixels that tell senders when you've opened their message. So you can read an email, completely ignore it, and the sender will think you're just busy or important. Honestly, it's one of the best features for introverts and perfectionists alike. So there you have it. 10 Apple Mail features in macOS Tahoe that actually make a difference. Mail has finally stopped being just that boring default app. Now it feels like a real tool, and honestly, maybe even a bit of a friend. Try at least a couple of these features, and you'll start wondering how you ever lived without them. Just don't be surprised if you suddenly become that person who actually enjoys checking email.